Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for right around the 14th, okay? So we're just going to see what comes up. What do we have for around the 14th? Six of Swords, Judgment reversed, and Knight of Wands reversed. So, Six of Swords is, uh, looks like we have somebody here that is going in a different direction. Okay, they're, they're, they're heading out of a situation. They're choosing not to, they're going in a different direction. So we have somebody here that's going in a different direction. They are moving on from a poor choice. I feel like they were unaware of something. There's been a lack of awareness or... You know they made a poor judgment call or they're right now right now they're they're having they're struggling with making a decision there's, there's been some sort of indecisiveness but i feel like a decision is being made um i feel like there's been some dishonesty here with judgment reverse somebody's been dishonest about their their readiness their readiness for change or their readiness for a new life they may have been dishonest with judgment reversed uh, judgment reversed is lack of acceptance, lack of forgiveness, lack of uh, awareness, um, unable to release. Uh, I feel like there's somebody here that um, is unaware. They're unaware of something. Uh, Knight, of, Knight of Wands reverse in the future. Putting a stop to something. I feel like we have somebody here that may have moved too fast. They may have they have may have made a poor judgment call. They may have moved it way 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 too fast because we have the moving with the 6 of swords. And then the knight of wands reverse is way 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 too fast. Moving way too fast, made a poor judgment call, judgment reverse. Somebody has moved way too fast, okay? Um Okay, let's get, let's get some more cards. Lack of truth or dishonesty with that judgment reverse. Somebody's been dishonest about the truth. Seven of Wands reversed. Three of Swords reversed. Eight of Pentacles. So, Eight of Pentacles is about putting in effort. Work, 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 work. So somebody is really focused on their work. They have been in a painful experience. Very, very painful. Um, they have their guard up. I feel like this is like stepping down, quitting, quitting with the Seven of Wands reverse. It's quitting and it's stepping down. It's admitting defeat. It's it's giving up, giving up, giving up. Somebody is giving up. They're They're choosing not to maintain the position that they were in they're giving up the position it's like I don't want to be in this position I don't want this position you know what I mean I'm moving on I'm moving on I don't want to be in this position I feel like we have somebody here that is very much focused on their work maybe that's what their main focus is they're focused on their work um, three of swords reverse that's that's typically leaving the past hurts behind but in this case, I feel like we have somebody here that is suppressing. It's like they're suppressing their their pain. They are. They're, they may be trying to fill a void, you know, trying to fill a void with... Um, some attention, just trying to get some attention. The Knight of Wands is very attention-seeking. Somebody is trying to fill a void. They're trying to get attention, but they have no intentions of following through with whatever it is that they said they were going to do. Because they are masking their pain. They're still suffering. They're still, it's like they're masking their pain. Somebody may be burying themselves in their work as well to mask their pain, you know? They just focused on their work, you know, their main focus. <clears throat> Six of Swords. I feel like I feel like uh, that's definitely going, going someplace else, moving in a new direction, uh, giving up, giving up. Uh, 
not willing to accept, not willing to accept this right now, putting a stop to something, maybe before somebody gets hurt. Somebody may be putting a stop to something before somebody gets hurt, but I feel like it's going to cause some pain either way. Ace of Wands. Ace of Wands is a new start. It's it is a new beginning. It's it's a uh, just go for it. It's a uh, new flame, a new match, a new passionate beginning. We have somebody here that has an opportunity because the aces are new beginnings. They have a new opportunity to start over, to start something over. I feel like we have somebody here that is going in a new direction. They have this strong desire to go in a new direction. And I think what they're going to do is they're going to stop. It's like they're going to stop uh, being dishonest with somebody. Because I feel like there's dishonesty here. I feel like we have an individual that is admitting their defeat. They're stepping down from their position. And they're going to be working in another direction. It's like they're going in another direction. Somebody's going in another direction. They've got this strong desire to build something up. This is somebody that has a skill. They have some sort of skill that they do on a regular basis. I feel like this is a very sudden decision. It could be a sudden departure. We, and, it, and it could, and it, and it hurts. Okay, it does hurt. I feel like somebody's going to get hurt with this sudden departure. I'm just being honest. I feel like um, stepping down. Stepping down. Somebody is stepping down. They are admitting their defeat. Moving on from a poor choice, suddenly. This is very sudden with the Nine of Wands reverse and the Ace of Wands upright. That's This is a sudden, it could be a sudden arrival or a sudden departure. Three of Swords reverse is on the path to recovery, but I feel like we have somebody here that has been suppressing their feelings. They have been suppressing their pain, you know? But this is the three of the three of swords reverse is also a very healing energy. So I feel like we have a we have a, a healing energy here where it's there's an opportunity to start over. Eight of Wands. Eight of Wands is uh, fast forward movement. It's typically good news arriving typically good news there's going to be something that is happening there's speeding here as well with the knight of wands reversed and the eight of wands i feel like we have somebody here that is going to be increasing their communication or they're going to be increasing their speed in a new direction they're leaving the past hurts behind where they've been suppress suppressing this pain they've been uh struggling with releasing maintaining their position but now they're moving on they are moving on trying really really hard putting in a lot of work 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 working working to create something because we the yeah working to create working ace of wands create somebody's working to create abundance with the eight of pentacles Somebody is working really hard to create their abundance and they're really focused on that. Really, really, really focused on creating, you know, the life that they want to live, the abundance. So we got, we got a worker here that is, you know, working a lot to create their abundance, but they're unaware that they have a match here because of that, that judgment card reverse is unaware unaware somebody it may be losing you know they could be losing because uh the seven of wands is reverse it's like stepping down giving up not fighting for the position maybe somebody is is losing uh they're losing something there's they're unaware that there's a match here 
or there's they're unaware maybe we have somebody here that is has another match you know they have another match and they're focused on that other match you know they're not focused on the one that's been fighting for them sun the sun is a yes card happiness joy rebirth renewal a breakthrough a life-giving energy happiness bliss leaving the past hurts behind this is your match there's going to be some sort of i feel like it's could be a sudden arrival, a sudden departure that leads to a sudden arrival. Could be either way, but this is this is extreme happiness. So there's going to be increased communication. There could be an arrival. Things could happen very suddenly. This is this is a, a renewal of some sort. This is a very positive energy, very positive, positive new life, positive new beginning here, increased communication, fast forward movement, extremely fast. Something is going to be happening extremely fast. Somebody is going to be increasing their effort. They're going to be putting in more effort after they. I don't know, maybe they weren't awoken, you know? Lack of awakening in that judgment card. Somebody wasn't awoken, you know, they weren't they weren't awake. They weren't ready for the position. They weren't ready for the position. Very sudden change. breakthrough new day new it's a new day it's a new day it's a beautiful day it's a beautiful day it's a beautiful day it is a beautiful day for fresh starts put it that way it's a beautiful day for fresh start starts and positive increased communication all right so there's some you know i feel there's the rods of love here as well so and the sun card is love so this is like being hit with love or hit with light or getting some sort of clarity this is exciting this is a new day it's it's a new beginning it's exciting it's very exciting somebody has a very exciting new beginning they've made a poor judgment call in the past obviously haven't we all Six of Swords. Six of Swords is moving. We may have somebody here that is moving. They're moving. They're going in a completely different direction. They are. They are definitely going in a completely different direction. Six of Swords is moving on. Giving up. Admitting defeat. Moving on. Putting in effort to something fresh and new and beautiful. Increasing. Things speeding up. Leaving the past hurts behind. Healing. Leaving it behind. Leaving it behind. Leaving it behind. I feel like we have somebody here that has been in some sort of mental confusion. They've been having a hard time accepting the truth of whatever the truth is. They haven't been able to accept the truth. Seven of Swords. Seven of Swords is, uh, let me get another one, but that's like planning. I think we have somebody here that's been planning something. This is somebody that uh, has been planning their escape. This is somebody that is very smart, very intelligent. It really is. Um, very cunning and clever. This person has been uh, try, maybe they've been taking things out of their house and bringing them here, you know, and getting ready, getting ready to leave, you know, getting ready. They've been slowly um, gathering their things and bringing them to their work or bringing them someplace, you know. Seven of Cups, reverse, seeing clearly what the best choice is. Now, I have all three cards together. 
I have the Seven of Wands reversed, the Seven of Swords upright, and the Seven of Cups reversed. Seven, seven, seven. Seven is a number from heaven. Seven is a very spiritual number, okay? It's a, it's a number of uh, spirituality and um, God, as far as I'm concerned. So there's some sort of... Uh, spiritual push okay there's some sort of uh universal involvement here as far as i'm concerned um seeing very clearly what the best choice is making a clear choice coming out of confusion we have some we do have somebody here that has been confused with their choices with their options they've been uh trying to uh, plan. It's like they've been trying to plan their escape or they've been uh, too busy, too busy to see, too busy to see what was right in front of them for somebody. Somebody's been too busy to see what was right and that's a whole nother message. Overwhelmed. Somebody's had so much going on. They've been overworked. They've had so many irons in the fire that they have been unaware of a perfect match or the piece of that match. They've been unaware that they've had a perfect option right in front of them. But on the other hand, I feel like we have somebody here that has been planning their escape. You know, they have been planning. They've, they've been in a position where they've had to fight. They've been dealing with a lot of opposition. They've been walking on eggshells and they've just been, you know, uh, struggling with leaving. They've probably been with, a, with, with another individual who... Uh, causes them a lot of anxiety for some reason this person's always poking them poke 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 anyhow i do believe that we have somebody here that is moving on they've been it feels like they've been uh gathering their things or whatever and and bringing them someplace you know in preparation of this departure whatever it is anyhow seven of cups reverse seeing very clearly what the best option is, becoming clear of a choice. If somebody is 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 uh, choosing another option. They've been confused. They may have been, you know, in a state of illusion by the looks of things. But I feel like there's some sort of clarity with a sun card. That's when everything becomes clear. So I do think that something somebody is is getting some sort of clarity. Um, Somebody may actually be uh, making an escape. They're just they're just quitting. They're just they're just quitting. They're just giving up. It's like you know I don't I don't want to be here anymore. I want peace and I want harmony and I'm leaving. You know that could certainly be the case as well. Um, we do have the Knight of Pentacles on the on the bottom, so this is a very practical. Uh, responsible decision a very practical responsible person that is wanting stability that is has some sort of skills this person has worked hard for what they have and they want to hold on to it and I feel like we have an individual that is making a very uh, wise decision to uh, maybe it's invest in something that is more solid stable and real um, somebody is going to be receiving an offer from an individual that is a very, very, very hard worker. This person um, is genuine and loyal. Okay, we have a genuine, loyal individual here who has a lot to offer. Okay, could I mean that's a golden opportunity. Okay, so somebody's going to be receiving an offer that really, really, really makes them happy. They are. Um, this could be from a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Um, this person uh, is real. Whatever they offer is real. It's solid. It's, it's, it is something of value. They have something of value to offer that can grow into abundance. And this is about abundance. It is. Choosing another option. 
that is more fertile and moving very, very, very extremely fast in that direction. Hermit reverse. There could be a rejection though. Somebody has been lonely. They have been really, really lonely. They've been in some sort of midlife crisis. Maybe they've been in a situation that was really, really dark that they needed to find a way out of. And I feel like they are finding a way out of it. I do feel like they are. Well, things are things are about to get lit up. Okay, here comes the light. This is definitely going towards the light, coming out of a dark period. I feel, I feel like we have somebody here that has become enlightened. They were not aware. They were not aware. Um, but it's almost like it's a wake-up call. They get some sort of wake-up call. They get some sort of epiphany that i got to go in this other direction because it's more fertile. The Ace of Wands is fertile. Um, very fertile. Um, hmm. Hangman reversed. Letting go, letting go. Somebody has been struggling to let go, but I feel like they're letting go. They've gotten their enlightenment. They've become enlightened. They're ready for a change. They've got a new perspective now. They've thought about it enough. A change is definitely, definitely, definitely coming. Somebody is releasing. They're releasing. They, they're ready. They're ready for something better. They're ready, they're ready for a new life. So they're releasing something. They don't have anything left to prove. They just want to be happy. I just want to be happy. I don't want to fight anymore. And somebody has been fighting. They have been fighting. All done wasting time. All done sacrificing myself. Going after happiness. Somebody's going to be communicating. They're going to be having a conversation with somebody that it may be a it may be a it may be a hurtful conversation, just being honest you know, that breaks them free from a situation and allows them to move forward. Going in a completely different direction, completely. Somebody has been dishonest about I don't know, maybe it's the competition with the Seven of Wands reversed right next to the Judgment reversed. You know, there's, that's like competition. They've been trying to avoid challenge because whoever they're dealing with uh, pokes them a lot. Poke, 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 you know, and puts them on the spot and likes to basically make them dance, you know. Sudden departure. Sudden change. This this hurts, but I gotta leave it. I gotta leave it behind. I gotta leave it behind. Because there's an exciting fresh start right here. So yeah, there is. Beautiful. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Freedom. Freedom. Freedom from suffering. It is. I mean, the sun card and, and the three of swords, freedom from suffering. This is, this is beautiful. It's bright. It's beautiful. It's, it's life-giving energy, right? This is where you can be accepted. This is being accepted for who you are. This is a breakthrough. It's a yes answer. This is a healing energy. It's also enlightenment. We have enlightenment here. Somebody is becoming enlightened. And they have been suffering. They have been suffering. There could be some some information or a fight that happens. And this is like, this is the straw that breaks the camel's back. I mean, the Ten of Swords reversed is, you know, it's the worst that has happened. It, it is. It, it's like, and this is freedom as well. So I feel like this is, it's... Breaking free from some sort of suffering. There's been a lot of suffering. There, there has. I 
I also, this is my third daily. I also see that somebody is going to be speaking the truth. We have the King of Swords. Okay, some sort of truth is going to come out. Um, it could be the harsh truth. Somebody's going to be telling the truth. It's like they get questioned and the truth comes out. Okay, it's, you know, this is the truth. It, it hurts. The truth hurts. So some sort of truth is going to come out. I also have, we also have an uncaring feminine here. Okay, it's almost like the masculine asks a question, the masculine energy. It could go vice versa, but, and, and, uh, or the feminine asks the question. Either way, somebody's going to get questioned and uh, the truth is going to be said. And it feels like, to me, what I saw was the feminine don't care. It's like, I don't care. I don't care. I, 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 don't, I don't love you. And I hate to say that, but because we had the Queen of Cups pouring, pouring the cup out. She was emptying, emptying the cup. She was emptying the cup. So, you know, that, that struck me. I mean, when, you, when you're pouring the love, you know, emptying the cup. See, she's emptying the cup. It's like you're, 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 you're dumping the love. It's like you don't want the love. This, I mean, you should be filling up the cup, not, not uh, letting it go. So somebody, we, I feel like we have an uncaring, you know, feminine here who she's just like, I don't care. I don't love you. I don't love you. I don't love you, you know, or this isn't what I want or something like that. You know, it's not about love. I feel like we have an uncaring feminine who's not in it for love. Um, and I feel like, like, or she's not emotionally available or she doesn't have good intentions or whatever. So I feel like we definitely have a, a feminine here and it doesn't matter what her sign is. I feel like we have a feminine here who just doesn't care. It's like non-caring. I just don't, I don't care. I don't care. It's like, it is what it is, it, you know, and that's what it is. It's like, this isn't love. This isn't love. So anyway, it's almost like, no. You know, you know, that kind of thing. Anyhow, I do feel like a new perspective is about to be gained, okay, with that hangman reversed in the sun card. Somebody's about to get some clarity. They're about to get some enlightenment. Somebody hasn't been telling the truth. There could even be some cheating going on, okay, with the seven of swords and the seven of cups here. You know, somebody may get caught cheating or they may, they may come clean about it, you know. If they get asked, they may come clean. Maybe there's another option. does look like there's another option here with the seven of cups. You know, there's another option and, you know, maybe it's just time to go in that direction. If that's what you want, then go. The, the Ace of Wands is go. The Ace of Wands is go for it. Just go. Just go. Pack up your stuff and go. I mean, I don't know. Good luck.